Hey, okay, so we are out currently outside of Lifetime Fitness. If you do not know what Lifetime Fitness, it is a expensive, fancy, but really nice gym. I've never been in here. Uh, the gym I always go to is closed on Sundays and I was gonna take a rest day. Then my friend's like, oh, let's get a guest pass to this other gym and then we can work out. And then when I woke up, he already worked out without me. So I went over there and they closed at four. And this was after I already took three scoops of pre-workout. So on my Instagram story, I was like, I just took three scoops of pre-workout and the gym is closed. And then one of my homeboys hit me up and he's like, hey, do you want like a guest pass to uh, Lifetime Fitness? Um, and I think you have to be there. Like they both have to be there. Uh, but I was like, yeah, I'm down. So I I, w I was already in my, my home depressed, but I did a quick change, drove over here. So now we're just waiting on him. And I think we're just going to record most of like what's inside because it's a big gym. Never been here. So might as well show you guys what I'm seeing too for the first time. Want to get a mansion, a jacuzzi, a theater to watch my movies, a couple whips and lots of fancy things. The kids, they call the goonies. I see the future, crystal ball, mirror, mirror hanging on the wall. Who the flies, white boy, you're the mall. Got your girlfriend screening all the calls. She bubbling, we fucking and you cuddling like baby And go to bed You interrogate that bitch like you the fed So she says she in love with a rock star Rock star Wanna smoke my weed So she asked me where the tops are Tops are oh, Top drawer oh. <laughs> Just left Lifetime Gym. Um, great gym, I'd say. But for workout wise, like machines and free weights, I'd say eight out of ten because it's kind of cluttered. Well, it's not cluttered. It's just like it's it's a huge gym. So you'd think there'd be more space for like free weights and stuff like that. But there's not too much. But it's not like it's packed or anything. So it, it was fine. Um, is it worth it? Not really, unless you're financially like well off, because that gym is a hundred dollars a month. My gym is ten dollars a month, and there's a lot. It's my gym is like pretty huge gym, a lot of space, mostly dedicated to like free weights and machines and stuff like that. This gym is like more of like a luxury gym with spas, pools, um, chiropractors, shit like that. Um, if I think this gym is like if you're retired 
or if you have just a lot of free time in your day, you don't work a full-time job, then you can make, get your money's worth out of this gym. But if you're just going to like go in and go out for like your workout, I'd say find just a cheaper gym and stuff like that. This is a nice gym. The lighting's great. Everything is great about it. But you, you could spend that money on something else, but no, no, it's all preference. Um, definitely not worth four hundred dollars a month if you're just gonna like lift weights and get out. I I don't have the free time in my day to constantly be going in that pool, the hot tub, and just walk around, just sit in the the little lounge and stuff like that. It's cool if you have friends, and I think if like you sign up with other people all together, it comes out a little bit cheaper. But if you're on your own. Not really worth it, but still great gym. I had fun. Shout out to my friend uh, Patrick who came in clutch with the guest pass. Would have had a shitty day without that. So I'm gonna rush home and do my one hour of cardio. Hate my life. All right. <laughs>